out there. Hope you're enjoying the weather. Sure, Bree is fine. Mark, we haven't heard from her in two days. She'll be okay. Bree's smart. Well, sometimes I think she's smarter than her parents. Okay, well, maybe not smarter than you. Down, storm trackers down. 
Well, good news. Storm's still here, no need to track it. Just, just keep driving. Oh, we're in the middle of a whiteout. Let me try and see if I can get more of a signal. Free! Whoa! Sorry. What are you doing? I only have a few more hours to get to my parents. We need to get them this data. There's no one else in the storm that's gonna help us. They're all... We're safe? In a bunker? Underground? I mean, got it. It's just you and me. We're gonna save the world. Yay. We get to fight a huge storm. Oh, no! Look! <laughs> Can you reverse the car? All right. It's collapsing! Oh. Oh, 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 Are sure we going in the right direction? Yeah, I mean, we're only a few more miles. I'm closer, I just need to find reception. I don't think we need that phone to know a storm is coming. We'll be inside soon. In the meantime, we just need to figure out the storm information as soon as possible so we can. So we can what? Beat this thing? Fine. I mean, the entire world is on lockdown, but you and I, yeah, we're going to solve this problem with a smartphone from Walmart. Hey, I, I didn't ask you to come with me. I know, I'm, I'm sorry. It's just freaking me out with the storm, the whiteout, all of it. it. People are dying, the world is dying. It's a lot. I know. You promise you'll save the world? I promise. It's from Best Buy. What? I bought the phone from Best Buy. But the warranty's still good. What are you doing? Here. Here, uh, I am trying to find a signal. There's a break in the mountains here. How can you tell? This isn't a wolf's natural habitat. Migration patterns must be changing. But I gotta put my environmental science degree to some good use, huh? Yeah, I brought you along here for a good reason. It wasn't just the woody banter and charming personality. No, not just that. We gotta go. We gotta go.
What? This isn't a field. It's a lake. Oh, do you think it's frozen solid? Seems to be. But it's still our best direct route. Let's just take it slow. What is that? Tyler. We should take, maybe we need to take a quick break. Uh, no, 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 we, we need to get inside. Look, I know we're building up sweat, but the temperature's dropping as it gets darker. It's dropping fast. Wait. Did you hear that? Yeah. They're all around us. Do we run? No, 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 no. move slow. If we run, they'll chase us. There! We need to get there. Come on. I'm just gonna go check over here. Bree, I think I found a way inside. It looks like a camp. Or school. Okay, I'm going to try my folks again and let them know where we are. Hello, Bree? Mom, Dad, can you guys hear me? Hello, Bree! Honey, we're here! Mom! Dad? We can hear you, Bree. We can hear you, sweetheart. I've been trying to get a hold of you, but even with the satellite phone, the storm has been keeping me from getting a signal. Tell us where you are, honey. Are you close? Tyler and I are coming back from our trip, but the car got stuck and they closed the roads and... But it's okay, we, we found shelter at this community college. Community college? Listen, I don't have much time. I think I might lose connection to the satellite, but I think I perfected the remote sensor prototype from your research notes. But that schematic was months off. But I, I think I should be able to gather the weather patterns and calculate the algorithms faster than anything else I've been able to come up with. But in order to take the readings, I need to take them somewhere where I can access the satellite while still avoiding interference from the storms. Then we're coming to get you. Uh, Dad! W what's the college, Bree? What, what's the name of the college? Direct Community College. Bree, can you repeat that? We couldn't make it out. Red Community College. Bree. Dad. D Dad, are you there? Mom! Bree! Dad? Careful. We've been hearing dangerous things other than the storms. Bree! Bree! Hello? Dad. Dad, are you there? It's okay. It's okay. We're gonna find you, I promise. Hello? Dad! Damn it. Oh, there you are. Hey, Mark. Hey, good to see you. Hey, you too. You Love too. Love the decor. Yeah, I call it uh, Arctic Doomsday Chic with a hint of lavender. Mm. <laughs> hey, Helen. Hi, Larry. Hi. Not looking so good, is it? No. We lost the generators about an hour ago, and even worse, we're down about three degrees across the board. Three overnight? Larry, where are those maps? Maps? Like paper maps? With GPS and cell towers down, we gotta go back to the basics. I don't know, they're somewhere over there. Yeah. Yeah, look, I think we've reached the point of no return. 
The final cold snap's coming in. These storms are only gonna get worse. Yeah. What are you gonna do? I'm all packed. I'm heading to the Air Force Base. I'm hoping that my family's there. More importantly, the military has set up a communications array. We've been talking to scientists all over the world, but the problem is we don't have enough data. We just don't understand these storms. We can't figure out. We found them. What are you doing? Bree is trapped with her boyfriend, Tyler. We have to get them. OK, where are they? At a community college. Which community college? Red. Red Community College? It can't be far from where they were going on their trip. How many colleges can have the word red in the name? Uh, here, here. Redwoods Community That's College, it. that has to be it. Mm -hmm. OK, you see that main road right there? We can take that, and even if it gets rough, we'll make it with the truck. Then what are you going to do? We'll meet you at the Air Force Base. But we have to get them. You guys give them hell, OK? We'll see you soon, somehow. Yeah. You saved those kids. Hey, by the way, you know what? You should take whatever you want from the lab, anything that you think is going to help you. OK, Larry, thanks. See you, Larry. All right, see what you can find in here, and I'm going to take a look around, see what else we can get. You mean steal? It's not stealing. I'm the boss. OK, boss. This will help. How's this for prepared? Tech, Badger, how do you hear me? Badger, Tech, your signal is weak but readable. I say again, your signal is weak but readable. Copy, probably the storm. Descending to 4,000. We have visual and looks to be recent movement on the ground. Request permission to investigate for survivors. Stand by, Badger. That is a negative. You are to return to base due to inclement weather. I say again, you are to return to base due to inclement weather. Tack, we have confirmed visual on what appears to be survivors. Acknowledge, we have confirmed visual on survivors. Request permission to check low at Tango 09 or 16. Roger, Badger. I say again, negative. Return to base. Immediate execute. Return to base. Unable, Tack. Unable. Out. Badger, what's our play? I'm going on. The rest of you are free to head back. We're with you, sir. All right, man. Let's go.
hands. Sorry if my hands are cold. Uh, cold hands, no more. Yeah. Would you like some wine with some of that cheese? Uh, how's it looking out there? Well, the teacher left. Left? What do you mean left? Tyler just walked out. Uh, yeah, things aren't great. We're almost out of supplies. Actually, it's just about all gone. There's only enough food to last us a few more days. The others need to know. Pretty. These kids got left here, trapped. They have no idea what to do. Kids, they're like two years younger than us. And if we hadn't shown them, who knows what kind of shape they'd be in. Did you get a hold of your parents? Yeah, but I could barely hear them over the cloud cover. But they said that they were on their way to help us. Your dad won't let anything get in the way of saving his daughter. <laughs> I'm sorry I should have got cut short. I was having a great time. Me too. But, uh, Tyler, we need to help these kids. Oh, kids? They're kids now. Tyler, we need to help them. Right. Everyone out there is on the edge right now. If we tell them that we're about out of supplies, some of them will be able to go off the deep end. Then we'll tell them help is on the way. My parents should be here soon. Hopefully they can get the van running and we'll be out of here soon. Look, I know, I know it sucks. I know you're all scared. So am I. But, but what we have to do now uh, is... Excuse me. I don't remember anyone electing you as spokesman or leader or whatever the hell it is you think you are now. Roger, don't. Besides... You don't even go to school here. No one elected anyone to do anything. Tyler and I are just we trying to... We have a van out there. We just need to get it running. That's enough. So, Roger, right? Uh, am I pronouncing that right, Roger? So, so, so what's your plan? Hey, you're the one who appointed yourself. You tell no, me. No, 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 go on, go on. You're in charge now. So, do you have the mechanical ability to get the van running? That's not what I'm talking about. And, and once you get it running, do you know how to clear the roads and figure out what to do next and, and where to go? Okay.
of it pretty well. We should have a gap of a couple of hours before it hits us. Yeah, we should be at the college within an hour if conditions stay the same. Hey! Hey, look at this. I'm kind of driving. Right, sorry. Listen, then. Uh, there's a strange anomaly not too far from here. Anomaly? Yeah. It doesn't seem to be affected by the storms. Are you sure it's not a malfunction or the satellite being affected by the weather? It might be, but if it's not. Huh. Mark, slow down. in no time. You know, I think school might be canceled for a little bit. <laughs> so, how long have you been going to school here? Oh, two years. I get my certificate in administrative support in the fall. Nice. <laughs> Thanks, it's just a secretarial degree. Do you go to school? Graduated, but um, I go back to grad school soon. <laughs> <laughs> how does that feel? It's okay. Yeah. Can I take it down? Damn. Yeah, these doors have seen better days. Well, let's try and get them open. You sure about that? Well, we still need to get out of here. <sighs> All right, give me a boost. Yeah. What do you see? <sighs> Nothing. We're completely trapped. <sighs> God, are you kidding me? We're trapped in here? Well, it's not our only problem. Well, what is it? When help arrives, how will they know how to get us? How can you stay so calm? Well, I was, I was raised by a couple of scientists. I was raised to think analytically and assess situations before panicking, but uh, yeah, we, we do need a hurry. Wow. My parents only taught me how to change my oil. Well, that's handy, too. <laughs> God. Look, let's not panic just yet. Okay, maybe let's split up. You know, find any other exits and windows and see if there's another way out. And if there isn't? <sighs> You're able to put it in neutral? Hang on! Okay, got it. Okay, hold on, we're gonna try to pull you out. 
sure this is gonna work? It'll work, it'll work. Start it up. Give it everything it's got. All the way down. Floor Keep going. Don't stop. Towards me. Yes. Come on. Come on. Good job. Good job. <laughs> you two saved our lives. Thank you so much. Where are you headed? Mother's Air Force Base. The bunkers are there. Is that where you guys are headed? No, we gotta find our daughter. She's at Redwoods Community College. Oh. That's only a few miles down the mountain. The first building at the entrance. Well, we'd both better get a move on if we want to reach our destinations before the storm hits. Okay. Are you sure you don't want to go to the bunkers? You guys gotta get to safety before it gets too crazy to be out here. Yeah, we're sure. We gotta get going. I mean, you just get your son to safety. Watch those icy patches, okay? There's still time to drive safely, but you need to leave right now. We will. Thank you so much. What do you say, baby? Thank you. You're welcome, buddy. Take care of your mom. Looks like we've got some heavy cloud cover. No! 
Snoopy, I've got multiple bogeys on my 12. Badger, do you have visual? Negative, Snoopy. Check your high-low. Everyone, anyone have a visual? I've got bogeys on my screen as well. Hey! Shouldn't we have visual? Clouds aren't that thick. Doesn't make any sense. Stay on course. It's gotta be the storm. Screw it with our instruments. I can't see crap in this. If our instruments are giving false echoes, we need to abort Badger. Roger that. Wait, what's that? Badger! Badger is down. I say again, Badger is down. Tap! Mayday! 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 really sealed off from everything. This ice has got to be at least six feet thick. Maybe we can build a fire and burn our way through. We have scraps, we can use that as kindling. I doubt we can make a fire thick enough to break through this ice. That won't take, what, 12 hours? And we don't have anywhere near that kind of time. There's got to be something in here we can use to dig our way out. We haven't searched everywhere in the building. We still have some time left. We'll take a break, come with a plan. You don't get it! Okay. Dude, what is your deal? Calm down. We don't have any time at all. Who knows when another avalanche might come right on top of us, maybe even a bigger one. That's enough. We need to do something now. What is that? Where did you get that from? Mom was in the janitor's closet with some tanks of propane. Stack them up against the doors and use this to set them off. You? I've been watching way too many shark movies. We blow it up. See if we can get the van running. If not, we start walking to find help. Look, I know it looks pretty bad, but I don't think it's a good idea to blow up our only shelter from the inside. Look, I just can't be in here anymore. Look, the avalanche hasn't buried the roof yet, and we still have that beacon oh, open. Stupid beacon. Yeah, the stupid beacon. But it's big enough to be seen from miles off, and, you know, we were saving it for a last resort. So how long are we gonna wait? Look, all I'm asking for is two hours. I'll go up to the roof, light the beacon, and if no one comes within two hours, then fine. Explode away. Brain. Are you sure about this? Of course I'm not sure. I think we're running out of options. Do you have any ideas? Two hours? Two hours. Taylor, help me with the beacon. about an 80 minute buffer. But Mark, the anomaly isn't going away. I don't think it's a glitch. I think it might be real. Where is it? It's just a few miles east of the school. <sighs> Damn it. We got a flat tire. I'm gonna go take a look. I'll make this quick.
Hands on the wheel. I, I, I don't get it. Why would a plateau not be affected by the storm? It must interrupt the flow of the weather. The shape and the altitude create a pocket where the storms just go around and over it, thus leaving the area protected from the elements. It's like, um, it's like a, a concrete post in a river. It just diverts the current around it. And over it? Do you want to argue with what we're seeing? I wasn't ready for that. It's getting insane out here. Even more than before, I mean. I got more bad news for you. What, we're losing ground? I don't think we're losing ground. I think the storm is picking up speed. I think if we can just get Bree's device to that plateau, we can get the data that we need to send back to Larry and the military to learn how to deal with these storms. The world's never going to be the same. We can't stop this. No, but with that data, we can learn to adapt as a species. Just wish we had any idea where we are right now, like how close we are to the college. It's just white. We should out. be here. I, I don't understand. We just have a landmark. Something would help. Anything. Rock slides. Or... Look out there. In the distance. Is that the school? Good job, Bree. I know I'm on the clock. How are you doing? I've been better. We're gonna get out of here soon. Yeah, we turned the place upside down. Couldn't find anything that would make a difference. No knives, nothing we can pry loose and use the makeshift pickaxe. Roger, I don't suppose you'd be willing to give us an extension? Sorry, guys. We made a deal. I expect to be taking care of some mice pretty soon enough. Just all at once. You just want to use that gun, huh? I'm just excited to get out of here one way or another. down and conserve some heat before my mom and dad get here. This is 
keep your eyes peeled for a way in. Something. It's small, but I think I can fit. Good eye. Yeah. Take one of these. If she's in there... If she's in there, you'll find her. And you'll find a safe way out. Just focus on that. We don't have much time. Try to use the hammer to break up some of the blockages, okay? And hurry up. We don't have a lot of time. I love you. I love you.
great, honey. Okay, radio me as soon as you find anything. Get back out here as soon as you can. I think you definitely have to call me Helen. Uh, <laughs> oh, uh, okay, so maybe you should start calling me mom from now on. <laughs> oh. Okay. Hey, I found everyone. Bree and Tyler are here with some others. That's great. We might have another problem. is gone. The rubble shifted, sealing it off. You're gonna have to find another way out before this storm hits. <sighs> Any ideas? Maybe. Dad, hello? Are you there? I'm here, sweetie. You okay? I'm fine, Dad. It's, it's good to hear your voice. You too. Everything going okay in there? You guys need to hustle your way out here. This storm is gonna be bad news for everyone. Working on it should just be a few more minutes. Shake a leg, hun. Hey, Dad, what side of the wall are you on? 
East. Why? Just making sure you're clear of the blast radius. It, it shouldn't be an issue. Blast radius? Bree. Uh, no, we've got it all under control. It's fine. I think. Bree out. Bree. Hello, Bree. Have kids, they said. It'll be fun and fulfilling, they said. You sure about this? Don't back down now, man. You got this. There's a lot that could go wrong here if it blows in the wrong direction. <laughs> yeah, but we're kind of out of options. They say you go to college here next year. Uh, yeah, I'm really excited for grad school. <laughs> hey, thanks for saving us. It wasn't me, it's was Tyler. Uh, yeah, you guys are all set. Man just had a loose battery wire. Uh, told you my parents taught me a little something about cars. <laughs> I, I'm uh, gonna make sure we didn't leave anything. I think my gunplay days are over. <laughs> well, the van's all loaded up. Uh, right at the Mathers Air Force Base, right? We're not, actually. It's the only place that's safe. That's where we're supposed to go when the roads are clear. We need to take care of something. You get yourself to Mathers Air Force Base. I'll take care of you. All right. Good luck. You too. I'm gonna go help Tyler. You saw. I thought you liked him. I like him. I just don't want him to know I like him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, our little girl. Oh. He's a good guy. She'll be happy. Come on. Come on. Uh, uh. 
<laughs> now we're talking. <laughs> Speed, altitude, fuel, fuel. Right. Okay, ignition. are being diverted, creating an area safe from the weather. Huh? Yeah, it's like an oasis. The plateau's protected because of its position. Like the way air flows over an airplane wing. I'm not sure I understand. Uh... You better get used to it, Tyler, if you're going to marry into a family of scientists. Hey, congrats, by the way. But we're going to have to celebrate later. The plateau's not too far. Well, I can get the readings and take them back to the scientific community. Dad, can we get there? Depends on the storm system. How bad is it? As bad as it gets. But we're right on the edge of it, though, so... We can stay in front of it if you can drive like hell. I'll do my best. Yeah, Mr. Jacobs. I mean... Dad. That's Mark. Just let me know if you need me to drive, or... Oh, engine trouble now? I don't think it's engine trouble. I think it's... Oh, so no! Look!
plateau won't stay protected. Eventually, the storms will be too powerful if we don't get the data before that happens. This truck isn't gonna make it. I don't care how good Tyler is with cars. What do we do? I have an idea. Oh, I know that sound. When's the last time he gave this thing some oil? I think the transmission's blown. Not a minute too soon. There's the outpost. They decommissioned it before I took over, so I have no idea what's in there. Minimal power for automated experiments and data, but my key card should be able to get us in. Well, it's better than nothing, and we can come up with a plan. Whoa, whoa. Explain to me what you think you're doing. Look, if we don't go out there, they're gonna come in. Maybe we can reason with them. Reason with them? We don't have anything they want. But be ready. It didn't take long for mankind to fall apart. Howdy. Howdy. <laughs> Looks like you ran into a little bit of car trouble. Unfortunately, the local auto shop is closed for the season. Y'all should have stayed indoors today. There's some mighty ferocious weather coming. Yeah, we were just passing through. Cars busted. Do you, do you know where we could borrow a car? Borrow? <laughs> well, even if I did, I'm not really much of the borrowing type. What's in the bag? I think that should interest you. Oh, you'd be surprised what interests me. Stamps, English literature. What's in your bag? We don't have time for this. There's a storm coming, a massive one. You are correct. Look, I'm a scientist. We need to get to shelter. I don't care. We're gonna take what we want. Everything we want. And that'll be that. First, I'll be taking that gun I saw peeking out from under your coat. Now. Get the bag. Not a chance.
doing okay? I can't believe how close we came. The plateau, I could see it. It can't, can't be less than five miles away. It may as well be a thousand. It's not over yet. We're still together, right? We have a window, Mark. Can you believe it? In about five minutes, we could get out of here and be halfway to the plateau. But according to these readings after that, the storms are so strong that they could last for months. We're done. Mankind, Bree, me, you. We're gonna figure something out. Yeah, and even if we do, then what? We learn to live with these storms. What kind of life is that for us, for Bree? When the world's populated by people like those guys. It's a life. That's what's important, right? We stay alive, and we collect as much data as we can. And that might allow us the possibility to create the technology to divert these storm patterns. Maybe even control and stop them. Who knows what mankind is going to come up with? But you need to believe, Helen. You need to believe. You. Oh, hi, honey. How are you doing? Hi, sweetheart. We're so sorry. We're all going to miss Tyler very much. I know how much you loved him. I'm so sorry. Well, you missed one of your dad's motivational speeches. <laughs> <laughs> oh, did I? Was a pretty good one. <laughs> Motivational speeches always remind me of one of our board members, Andrew Capello. <laughs> Holy crap, Andrew Capello. <sighs> Dad! Larry told me that Andrew parks his SUV up here. I don't know if he's trying to hide it from his wife or it's a tax thing. But I know he parts in the storage building, so there's got to be keys here somewhere. Got him! That's not the storm. Get ready to run for the car. between the storms. It's not gonna last. We have to go. Hmm. Wait, what about Dad? You should know your mother better than that, all right? Get it started. We will be right out. You need to stop this and just let us go, please. There are bigger things at stake. There are lives at stake. Yak, yak, yak. Hey! Nobody messes with my family. I found the back door. Come on. Come in. Mathers Air Force Base, this is me. Where are you? 
Mathers Air Force Base, please come in. Mathers Air Force Base, please reply. Unidentified aircraft, this is Mathers Air Force Base. Do you copy? Hi, hi. I mean, copy, copy. Yeah, um, I'm trying to get to you. Where are you? a pilot's license.
was nothing. Something's wrong. It's more power to push through. May I see that? Yeah. Mom, what are you doing? If I wire this in series with my tracker, it should give us enough power, right? Okay. All set. Try it now. It's working! It's gathering the data any minute now. It's analyzing the systems. It worked! I knew it would! You did it, sweetie! It's transmitting!